Hey guys, I just wanted to make a little video of some homemade solar panels. I bought the cells from solarcells101.com. This panel on the right has two sets of 3x3 three three cells. There's 39 cells in each set. And the two sets are wired in parallel. The next panel is 39 or 38 I think there are 3 by 6 cells which are real nice to work with I'm not sure how this is going to come out with the reflections and then over here I have a small panel of 2 by 3 cells which were kind of fun to work with if you're just getting started these little cells are a little easier, they're not quite as fragile. There's 32 cells in this little panel. So that's three panels. One, two, three. I'll try to go inside and get a reading. The sun's alright today, but Right now it's around quarter after one in the afternoon. The two big panels out there, I actually have those hooked up to my grid tie inverter. Let's see if we can get a couple readings down here. Right now the big panel is going through the grid tire, 3.3 amps. That's at like probably 15 volts. Alright, I'll show you the shorted, shorted, shorted amperage is 6.8 right now, earlier it was 7.5 something, I think I could hit 8 pretty easily on a nice sunny day. I hooked to my battery bank. Probably push. Right now my battery bank is full, so it's actually 14.2. You can see that the light blinking here. It's actually regulating the voltage so you don't overpower your batteries. So that's for the big panels. You can watch my lights here in my grid tie inverter. I have other solar panels that are hooked to this grid tie inverter. See the green light going back and forth. Watch it pick up when I hook the two big panels. See the light speeds right up. Alright, now I'll take a look. This amperage here will be for that little panel with the 2x3 cells. That's 0.8 amps, which is pretty good for that little panel. Like I said, I bought the cells from solarcells101.com you go right to his website there he's got a bunch of stuff on there good prices real nice guy to work with down here I got my feeding the grid got 127 watts going out right now gets up around one 170 with my homemade panels and my store bought panels which is not bad seems to be around 11 30 12 o'clock when I'm getting the best power out of it right now of course it's winter time so hopefully in the summer I'll get a little more so the big panels that we looked at earlier are making like 21 they're making about 20 volts open voltage and somewhere around 8 amps open so it's right around 80 watts per panel which I was kinda of hoping to get out of them and that little panel I think is about 16 watt panel so if you get a few minutes 
check out solarcells101.com check out some of the cells he has he has all different types maybe start out with a few smaller ones to get yourself going alright guys that's my update a little earlier we had some wind damps coming in let's just gauge back here It's always nice to see a windmill turning, so let's see if we can get a peek of that before I end the video. Yeah, she's spinning. Nice cold, raw, windy day. Of course, I don't know if we'll be able to see anything. It's so bright out here. It's spinning pretty good. Considering there's all trees around us, it's on a 20 foot tower. Alright, guys, thanks for watching.